Hey, don't touch me there. This is my no no square. Stop, 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 don't touch me there. This is my no no square. No, but. Seriously, we all learned that for a reason. It's bad to touch people, especially in their no-no square. Duh, Illy. Harassment is illegal. Yeah, duh. But it still happens, even where you least expect it. What? Chick-fil-A. Yep, home of Jesus' favorite chicken sandwich. Exposed! Well, no, it's not their fault. It was this one guy who worked there. He? He touched me there. He touched- <laughs> I don't have any sense of rhythm. Anyway, so this guy's name was- Jimmy. He was hired around the same time as I was, and we worked a lot of the same shifts. And at first he was just... whatever. Just some guy that I saw Tuesdays and Thursdays from 7am to 2pm before going to class from 4pm to 10pm. Oh boy! But about two months in, my coworker pulls me aside and says, Hey, watch out for Jimmy. He's been groping me and other girls in the back kitchen where no one can see. Pfft. Well... Why didn't they just say no? Oh, my silly misogynistic friend. You see... Well, why didn't they just tell a manager? Oh, that one's easy. Well, why didn't they just fire him? Touching is bad. I don't know, buddy. Maybe because they didn't... <laughs> May I direct you to the FFAQ, the female frequently asked questions. After a few shifts, it happened to me. It started small and innocent. He'd get really touchy when talking to me. He'd surprise poke me dangerously close to my boobs. And finally one day he walked behind me, but he didn't just casually stroll on by. No. No, no, no. He rested his hands on my shoulders, dug his fingers into my shirt so I couldn't move, and thrusted his no-no square against my no-no square. And for some personal reference, I was in an abusive relationship for five years. I know the difference between an honest mistake and a purposeful, disgusting choice of behavior. And I decided from then on that I would fight back. So what did I do to Jimmy? Did I punch him? Did I kick him in the nuts? Did I scream for Chicken Jesus to smite him? Vote now on your phones. Time's up. No, no, no. Sorry, I did something much worse. Don't you fucking touch me. Ever again. Uh, oh, okay. And he never messed with me again. Or made eye contact. Sounds like a win to me. But look, contrary to popular belief, it is not very easy to say, Look, dude, I I'm just trying to restock the Christian mayonnaise. I, I, I really don't think that involves grabbing my boobs and my butt. C can, can you please just stop? P -p Pretty please? Why not? All you have to do is say no. <laughs> oh, my silly victim shaming friend. You see, that's not part of the job. And it's not my job to tell him that. I shouldn't even be dealing with this, especially at Jesus' favorite fast food eatery. God bless. Go in peace. Seriously, I, ugh. I don't know about you, but when a stranger bumps into me out of nowhere, I get a little spooked, and it's a whole other terrifying experience to be touched in your no-no square by a stranger where no one can see what happened and where it's your word against his. And he knows that. That's why he did it. He knows he'll get away with it. And guess what? He did. So all we have left in terms of defense is warning each other about these kinds of people and dealing with it until someone believes us and gets rid of him. And to people like you who question the credibility of all of us coming forward, rather questioning the character of these kinds of people, boy do I have news for you! You're not helping, you're not helping, your friend sent you this song cause you're not helping. Look, if your friend came up to you and said, help, this guy just punched me in the face, would you say, uh, look, he's a good guy. Whatever he did, maybe you just took it the wrong way. What, d dude, he punched me. Right here. Yet yeah, you say that, but I'm sure you just got in a fight and now you regret it. Wait, 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 what? Well, I'm sure if he really did punch you, that he'd be fired. Punching is wrong. Duh. Oh my god, why am I even friends with you? Hey, don't use the Lord's name in vain. We're in a holy place. <laughs> God bless. Eventually I left, not entirely because of him, but because I got an internship. Yeah! And here I am now, in my own little 
No, no, square. My closet. Hey y'all, thanks for watching the video, and thanks for like 2,000 new subscribers all coming from James the Odd Ones Out. In case you missed it, I was part of an MAP, and it was really cool and it hit trending, and it's lit! So if you're new, welcome, and if you're not, welcome back, and uh, make sure you hit the bell, cause I'm in college, lol! I don't know when I'll be posting, bye! <laughs>